You lost your dog for five minutes, and I lost my daughter. You can go fuck yourself. Ah, the wonderful world of Netflix. Seriously, where would we be without it? Maybe you could have brought some food home instead of a fucking six-pack. Jesus fucking Christ! Just when we think that they can't air a better show, they always somehow surprise us. But we're not here to rant about how awesome Netflix really is. No. In fact, today we heard Comic Soup are going to be taking a quick look at some awesome moments from an awesome series called Made. But before we begin, be sure to hit those like and subscribe buttons if you enjoyed this video so you never miss more topics just like this one. Yes, the subscribe button. Just click it. It's free. Now, if you're familiar with the Netflix title Made, then you should also be well acquainted with the character Alex, played by Margaret Qualley. She, of course, needs no real introduction, especially considering she's made the set of shows like The Leftovers and Quentin Tarantino's Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. She has also received an Emmy nomination for her role as Dancer and Twinkly. But why is all this important to this video? Well, it's just a brief background into the kind of person Margaret Qualley really is. There's no way I'm gonna back out. Considering she's no stranger to the big screen play, it's of no real surprise that she, let's say, outperformed herself as Alex and Maid. As a viewer, we could see every emotion she felt as if she were right in front of us. We could also see that her acting is definitely one for the history books. So, in honor of her Emmy-worthy performance as Alex, here are 20 amazing but sorrowful Margaret Qualley moments in Maid. Fair warning, this is perhaps going to be a speedrun, so buckle up. And with that, let's get started. Number 20. When a driver hits Alex's car as she's running frantically on the freeway, trying to find Shmario for her daughter Maddie. We couldn't make this list without including this scene, and for good reason. Everything happened so fast. From Maddie screaming for her door to the driver hitting the car she was in. We all probably had goosebumps watching this scene. But to make this moment even more epic, we got to see how well Qualley captured all the ups and downs beautifully. Trust me, she couldn't have done this scene any better than this. Number 19. When Alex finds herself all alone at the ferry station. In this scene, Alex finds herself alone with her daughter Maddie at the ferry station. She cries quietly to herself, all the while trying her best to entertain Maddie with Shmario on the door. This is, of course, another scene full of exceptional acting skills. Crawley not only showed her ability to take up such an emotional line, but she also showed us how stressed a person can be not having someone reliable by their side. Number 18. When Alex tells Regina off. Who, of course, can forget such an exciting moment in the series? After she was inadvertently involved with Danielle in dognapping Mr. Darcy, Alex eventually confronts Regina in a scene that is so satisfying for everyone watching. We know Alex to be a sort of an introverted character, so seeing her pop off like that was really enjoyable to watch. Number 17. When Alex helps out an intoxicated Sean, even though he's trying to take Maddie away from her in court. This moment perfectly sums up how complicated Alex's relationship was with her ex-husband and abuser. But on the bright side, we got to see two very talented actors, Qualley and Nick Robinson, play their characters together, and that's what really matters. Number 16. When Alex tells Regina that she lives for her daughter. Is there really anything more beautiful than a mother's love for her child? And Qualley definitely proves it in this beautiful scene. But what's even more amazing is the wholesome feeling we got from watching both Qualley and Annika Nori Rose work their magic together in this scene. Sure, they both play such reserved characters, with Alex referring to Regina in her notebook as the <coughs> But there is no denying how beautiful it was when they finally opened up to each other. Most importantly, when Alex says she lives for her daughter. Do you like being a mom? I live for my daughter. Number 15. When Alex narrates what her home would look like after Regina tells her about her divorce and son. Hey, I may have an awesome voice, but I feel only Qualley's narration can best capture the moment she said, Our space is a home because we love each other in it. And that's when the tears start rolling down my eyes. I'm not crying. You're crying. Cue the tears. Our space is a home because we love each other in it. Number 14. When Alex realizes that she hid in the cupboard as a child because her father hurt her mother. Alex is well known to be a yes woman, and she never shies away from swallowing her pride for the betterment of her daughter. But whenever Alex goes off her own character, we consider it just as emotionally effective, and it's all thanks to Qualley. Imagine acting a character within a character and making it look easy. That's Qualley for you. Number 13. 
The heartbreaking moment when Alex's landlord kicks her out because of Sean's reckless behavior at Maddie's birthday party. It was a simple yet emotional scene that reacts perfectly to an unfortunate circumstance. Alex just cries in her car without making a beat, and that literally describes how she feels about the whole ordeal. Once again, Quali captures such an emotional moment that we just couldn't resist adding it to the list. Number 12. When Alex tells Nate that they are not equal. Now, everyone knows Alex is, of course, very attached to Nate, and to the best of our knowledge, the feeling was definitely mutual between the two of them at one point. However, Alex does believe that there could be something hidden underneath the whole nice guy act, even though his generosity is basically what keeps her and her family from living in the streets. This scene is probably one of the most decisive moments in the series, and the acting, of course, didn't disappoint. Number 11. When Alex freezes after her mother breaks into her own home and hurts her hand. Her reaction says it all. Alex just basically took a while to process what had happened. She doesn't even talk throughout the whole ordeal, but we could definitely see the genuine shock on her face. We could even feel the anxiety slowly creep in as Alex starts to weigh in on how much of a responsibility her mother was starting to become. Number 10. When Alex tells her mum that she loves her at the hospital. This moment brings us back to the reference, is there anything more beautiful than a mother's love for her children? Only for this scene, it's the reverse. Throughout the series, we could definitely see the chemistry between Qualley and her real-life mother, Andy McDowell. But in this scene, that chemistry got amplified into a beautiful mother-daughter moment that we just can't forget. Please, stop. Please just talk to you. I love you. I love you, Mom. And Maddie loves you. So many people in your Please. life. Please! Number 9. When Alex takes her daughter on a bear hunt. These mother-daughter moments always get us, which is why there are a lot of them on this list. What can we say? It's simply touching. Not to mention the fact that Qualley and Rylan Nevea Whitted, or Maddie, both also share a beautiful chemistry together. It's almost as if their relationship was meant to be, and we believe that's what actually carries the show. Number 8. When Alex becomes horribly depressed after Sean demonizes her for getting into college and returns her car to Nate. In that moment, I'm pretty sure we could all feel for Alex's emptiness and loss of hope. It was a moment that perfectly captures pure anguish, and Alex definitely had a void-like feeling afterwards. At the time, we couldn't help but feel sorry for everything she was enduring. It was just utterly gutty. Number 7. When Alex takes Maddie away from the trailer after finding her in the cupboard. After Sean yells and throws things at her, Alex instinctively finds her daughter hiding in a cupboard, and all she could think about at that moment was getting both of them to a safer place as quickly as possible. Besides the abuse from her ex, this scene is yet another beautiful mother-daughter moment that we just can't forget. Number 6. When Alex meets her first client outside of Value Maids. What's awesome about this moment is how well it captures Alex's kindness, intelligence, and willpower in the face of a client suffering from a hoarding problem. Of course, some may not agree with this, but if you understand the true meaning of the scene well enough, then you know what I mean. Number 5. When Alex saves Sean. It's one thing to have an abusive ex, it's another to serve under such a person, and that is exactly what Alex did. As a means to get full custody of her daughter, Alex had to serve under her abusive ex, Sean. This moment perfectly tells us that there is nothing a mother won't do for her children, even basically going into the lion's den just to get her child out. Number 4. When Alex confronts her mother about being homeless. In this heartfelt moment, we could really see how Alex's knowing stares and worries really grounded her mother's chatty nature. Yes, ma'am. Let's focus on the important things first. Number 3. When Alex confronts her dad. In this truly painful scene with her father, Billy Burke, Alex immediately realizes that her own father would never have her back. Sadly, she gives up on the conversation altogether by saying, then I guess we don't have much to say to each other. This moment is extremely heartbreaking because of the circumstances that lead to it. On one hand, Billy feels sympathetic towards Sean for his struggle with alcohol addiction, and on the other, he refuses to acknowledge the fact that Sean emotionally abused his daughter. We can understand why he feels sorry for Sean, but come on, she's your daughter. At least acknowledge her struggles first. Number 2. When Alex tells Paula that she's going without her. Here, Alex eventually decides to leave her mother and move on with her life regardless of how much she felt the need to care for her. Although she wasn't too keen on her mother's recent romance, she still fought the urge to help her through. This was a defining moment in the series, and once again, Qualley shows us her ability to read between the lines perfectly. Number 1. When Alex describes her happiest day to her writing group. Although Alex does claim that her happiest day hasn't happened yet, she did paint a little picture on how her near future would look like. We also can't help but feel enlightened by Qualley's narration, which actually brims with a somewhat tentative sense of hope for a good life, despite all that Alex has been through. We can even consider the narrative a powerful message not just for the character, but also for the viewers. And there you have it for the top 20 Margaret Qualley moments in Made. So, which one of these did Qualley really ace? 
Did we miss out on any of our awesome moments from the show? Share your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe to the channel for more amazing content. For now, my friends, hasta la vista. That this whole new world is for her.